Hey everyone, Shea Bear 1000 here. I got a monkey beside me. You can't, really can't see her because we have a mystery box again. Yeah. So, cool. yeah. Here it is. We're going to open it up. I can tell you who it's from. I don't didn't know it was coming. I don't know anything about it. But it is from Golf Professional out of Opelika, Florida. Like I said, don't know what it is. Hmm. But interesting we'll see what it is so it is a true mystery box again so let's get to this and open it up i don't know if we'll be able to do a review because i don't know what it is but let's at least do an unboxing yep <laughs> stick around okay so here we go i'm gonna open this up see what's in here well I didn't know that watch was coming either No. monkey borrowed my watch today because she went walking yeah. she walked almost a mile and a half huh monk yeah okay let's see what this is all right we got some stuff here um, okay I think I can read this oh Huh, never mind. Now I know who it's from. Uh, enjoy your early, enjoy your gift early Christmas present. Be careful cooking bacon naked. <laughs> because remember you, I, well, I said that and you said it's true. <laughs> Marlon Bryan Aww. from Marla Patton, Aww. from my cousin. So uh, these are, these things are. So let's see what this is. Wow. Thank you guys. Yep. Stainless steel. Oh my god, you're oh. kidding. What? You know what it is. No. I'm gonna find out. Don't ruin it for me. I won't. <laughs> I should have waited till Christmas now. <laughs> I was like, cause she was walking a mystery. I said, we got another mystery box. It's from golf professional so I don't golf <laughs> I thought you know anybody sees my videos knows that I don't know maybe they're I don't know I'll, per, I'll promote them I guess <laughs> all right Ooh. check this out mm -hmm. it says stainless steel oil filter pot yep and you know what it is yeah what do you do with it put your grease in it cooking grease Oh, that's what this is for. Yeah. Oh. Remember we mentioned it? You mentioned it on yeah. the video. Oh, we did. Thank you, guys. <laughs> yep. Thanks, Marla. <laughs> <laughs> I got the best family in the world, man. Yes, you do. I'm serious. I do. <laughs> my whole family's... My whole family's awesome. That is cool. That will be so handy. All right. So now I know what it is. Yep. <laughs> Thank you so much, because I had mentioned that. Yep. Now I won't have to use my bowl. That was fast because that was just the other day I yeah. found that. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. That is just... really cool. Aw, oh, neat. Yep. Well, so I guess that's for pouring it. Uh huh. Yeah. That's... There's the strainer. Yep. And then I can pour my bacon grease in there. Because mm -hmm. we have it in a container, but it's not covered or anything. We don't strain it. Like I said, she usually, she'll dump it in the trash or sometimes I'll bring it out here for the animals. Because animals like that stuff. It's bacon grease. It doesn't, it doesn't hurt them. So now I can reuse it, the mm -hmm. bacon grease, for eggs and stuff. Yep, there you go. That is so cool. Very nice. Thank you, guys. There it is. That'll be very handy. Let's get a thumbnail here. Let's put the lid on it. We'll get a thumbnail. And it'll match the kitchen. Yeah, yeah, it will. Mm -hmm. Very cool. I might not even use that as a thumbnail. It's a mystery. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> there, monkey's back yeah. in here now. Yeah. Thank you guys. I appreciate it. Thanks, cuz. Yeah. Very cool. 
You would love them guys. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, awesome man. Um Moldis daughter is named after her sister. Amberly. So yeah. And uh but yeah, last time I seen Marla been several years ago, of course, way before I moved down here. Mm -hmm. Uh at like a family reunion we had. Mm -hmm. And her and Brian had rented a cabin. And uh so uh, me, my ex, and her and Brian and my uncle all hung out and mm. after the thing, mm -hmm. all hung out for a few hours and had some drinks and cool. um, ate food and stuff. It was a really good time, man. That's my uncle Butch. He's cool. You'd like him. Yeah. Yeah, he's funny. <laughs> Thank you guys so much again. I really appreciate that's yeah, it's gonna be put to work, that's for sure. I didn't know what it was. I was like, he talked about getting one and I always wanted one and always used cans or something and you know. Well I thought I would just get a mason jar, but then I thought, well what if the heat cracks it? And then I'll have a mess and she'll not only will I have a mess, I'll have a goose egg or two on my head. <laughs> because <laughs> she knocked me out a couple times but yeah this is awesome thank you so much and yes yeah. i will enjoy it and i will be very careful cooking bacon naked bacon naked yeah i got popped the other night <laughs> i wasn't naked though <laughs> but i have been known to do that like when your mom's in the hospital or mm. in the rehab center or whatever you know Mm -hmm. I'm just, I'm free. <laughs> yeah, he is. <laughs> She's like, you're walking past there. The front window's wide open. I'm he like, don't care. Look, if they want to stand out there, whatever. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> it's my home. <laughs> I mean, I'm dressing and nighties and everything. <laughs> I've never, ever been that kind of person. But I hardly ever cook with a shirt on because it's so hot in there. He, he get, it does get hot. And Especially he, like when I'm filming. Yeah. Oh, I've shut the air off because of the noise, you know, yeah. for the camera. And um, it really gets hot in there. So yeah. when I'm not filming, I have my shirt off, the air conditioner on, I'm still just. Well, it he gets hot in there. It, so. Yeah, everybody yeah. else is like, it's cold in here. I'm over there. <sighs> Shut up. This is really cool. I'm so glad. <laughs> Thank yeah, you so much. This is really yeah, nice. Yeah, we, we this really is needed gonna this. It's going to be so handy. Yeah, because, um, you know, like I said, I can reuse that grease that we've been throwing away for all these years. Because I mean, remember my grandma had something similar to this. Mm -hmm. My grandma on my dad's side Yeah. had something similar to this. Um, I think it was just an actual, <laughs> like an old... Uh, mm -hmm. I think it was just an old coffee pot or something, but it yeah. was similar to this, yeah. that she would do that when it cooled down, she put the lid on. And I remember whenever she'd make eggs or especially like green beans and she would grab a scoop of that and throw it in. Cause really it's lard mm -hmm. That's all and it flavors is. stuff. You know, it's good like what cooking hamburgers cause you get that bacon flavor in it. Mm -hmm. Thank you, I really do appreciate it. You guys are awesome, man. <laughs> Tell everybody said hi, I miss them and I love them. And we'll see all you, all you guys in the next one. Um, I got a, another spooky story coming up. Yes, you do. This one's gonna be scary, so mm -hmm. hold on to your hats, guys. If you don't wear a hat, hold on to your significant other hat. If they don't wear a hat, grab something. Mm -hmm. Because it's gonna knock your socks off. Probably not, but it's cool. And these these are stories that I make up as I go along. I mean, I think about it a couple days ahead, kind of get an idea of what I'm gonna talk about, and then I just make it up as I'm telling it. So these are not true stories. The fairy thing, I don't know what that was about. Probably a bug, but a very interesting, wasn't it? Yeah, it Looked like a fairy. It does. <laughs> but being an investigator and not a hunter, I gotta investigate it, so it could be. Never know. I don't personally believe in fairies but i can be proven wrong you know never know you never know look like one but it could be a bug but i've been watching them things for months yeah months i keep telling her i said i'm seeing fairies out there she's like yeah you are a fairy i'm like no i'm serious she said what 
I said, wait, someday I'll show you. And then one night I said, come here, check this out. And there was one bug or whatever it was flying around there. She was like, and I paused it. She was like, that does look like it's got legs and stuff. And this one, I just walked in the garage, lit a cigarette, looked up, and I seen that and I was like, oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> I was calling her, come here, you got to see this. Interesting. My guess is some kind of maybe moth or something. Awful big moth. I, I don't, well, remember, it's close to a camera. I know, so, but still, it's bigger than Well, this than ain't very big. But when you put it up here, it looks like it's bigger than our heads. You see what I mean? Mm. You just kept going, it's not a bat. <laughs> no, no, it ain't a bat. A bat would have just blocked out the camera. You wouldn't even have seen it. Yeah. But, so, I, I would say it's probably a bug that I've been watching these things fly around. But, um... But it was still interesting and cool and i figured well it is halloween time let's yeah. throw it up there right. you know right. uh, maybe someone else has got some stories too they'd like to share bleep bloop it down below bleep, bloop it. yes thanks again guys <laughs> i love you guys man i tear up every time Aww. yeah well i, I miss my cousin <laughs> so <laughs> thank you guys very much appreciate it and um happy halloween to y'all shea bear the myth man legend I'm gone for now like it's a shout. Bye, y'all. <laughs> Bye, guys.